Friends, in today's video, we are going to make the most simple, powerful, portable light hydroelectric generator in today's video the hydroelectric generator is this is completely different from all other hydroelectric generators because whenever we go on an adventurous journey you have to face many dangerous problems in such a situation if we do not have electricity and there is a river drain or waterfall nearby then we can use this i am making this design using a type of hydroelectric generator electricity can be generated by using it friends whenever we face problems in any adventurous journey then, only our knowledge, skill and presence of mind comes in handy. We had made a super hybrid cycle which also had a motor attached, if we are any adventurous person with this. When we go on a journey and there our battery of laptop or mobile gets discharged. Hydroelectric generator can be made from its motor, i.e. 24 volt motor, or not. And if we make it, how powerful will it be and will there be charging and lighting, whether it can be done or not, you will know all these things in today's video, because we are going to make the simplest hydroelectric generator, which you can also make. Can so let's start without any delay. But I will make it using iron only, because I have iron and I am not going on any adventurous journey right now. However, this design can also be made very easily from wood. Friends, now I am going to make it, but before that please like this video and if, if you have not subscribed to our channel then subscribe, but, but if you have already watched the videos on our channel then you would know or if you, if you are watching for the first time then you should know that all our videos, there are technical things, there is something amazing, there is something unique, so you our channel, subscribe to let's start making. absolutely comfortably. Let's pick it up and put it down. So friends, our entire system is completely ready. Now we have come to test, are on this dam. This dam is very dangerous. Set up here. It is also a very difficult task to do. So this is a challenging task for us. Now we, people are going to take it, but the best thing is that two men, together we can take it from one place to another. Friends, the water pressure here, so much so that it must work 100%. If it is working then how? Used to be? How much power is it giving? All these things remain to be seen. Very little water is coming out. This place looks safe. One side has too much water, and the other side has too much water. Is coming out. As soon as the dam is lifted, the speed of water will increase. Friends very deep, it is too much, and bringing it down is a big challenge. We will bring it here with the help of rope. After tying it, first hang it at the top, and then slowly take it down. We'll go. Hold hold. Hold hold. 
It is very dangerous, there is a lot of water here and from here. Water drains very fast. But the gate has created a lot of security. Very thick. Is feeling very cold. Stop 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 one minute. Take me there 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 is very strong water pressure here. My pants also got wet. When I feel like my feet will get cut off, the water is so cold. Yet we are here, but we have to experiment. Romu, the flow of water here is so strong that this generator may start. Come on Romu, let's keep it at the right place. Okay, yes, wire, wire. Friends, you can see here that the wire has come from above. Now let's connect it. Tape also. Want Romu catch the tape? If he falls then he is done with his work. Twenty four volt motor is installed and this also generates electricity. There is a gate of the dam. Now it will be lifted then water from below. It will come out with very strong pressure and it will start dancing like this, then this electricity will start generating. From here is the lifting mechanism. Now I am leaving from here. To lift. You can see there that water is not falling yet. But fall now immediately. It will start soon. The gate began to rise. Is the wheel has started turning there? Now it remains to be seen how much power or how much electricity is being generated. Although it is a 24 volt motor so let's see how much is being generated. I think even if it gives 12 volts then we can. We can convert it into AC. After that we can run whatever we want. Watching. How much is generated? Now here I am going to check the voltage. How much voltage is coming? You can see there it is rotating perfectly. Is so now let's check its voltage. Here we can see that it is only 8 volts. Is being generated. See this is only 8 volts. You can see it here after some time. Now it is going to be 10 volts because from there the gate is being raised more so that the voltage increases. So here you can see that the speed of water is increasing. Anyway the voltage is also starting to increase. It's been pretty fast, guys over here. The mechanism is working very perfectly. A lot. Is also strong. You can see how perfectly it is working. Pretty much there. There is also a dangerous situation. If this system remained weak then the water pressure. In that much it would break. Flows away in water. You can see here that now it is generating 10 volts. Let's see now. Uh, this is a DC motor. Let's try it and see if it is working or not. Oh yours. It is going on, but we do not know whether it is going on or not. Although it is going on. I am showing you another motor in its place. Oh look at this, look at this, I'm fingering it. That's why it is going on. Friends, this wire is directly from the hydroelectric system. Is coming you can see its spark here. Look how bright this bulb glows. Is doing I am going now, to check the amperage of short circuit. After all, how many watts is this system giving right now? Is, because the whole game happens in electricity on what? So here I, connecting directly. Put a wire here and put a wire here. Oh yours. Right now it is giving approximately 13 amperes and 10 volts i.e. 130 watts. Is being here you can see both the motors are running together and here. The bulb is also glowing. You can see that it is a 55 watts and the motor is also taking energy i.e. that both are able to run it together. So friends, as we started, thought that this is a very powerful motor and can generate a lot of electricity. This is exactly what it is generating. However the voltage is giving less and the motor, it is absolutely small, it is generating 130 watts from such a small size. That means we are a big, you can make a bulb glow, charge a laptop, charge your mobile, and many small and big gadgets can be used while camping. This system is not too heavy either. Can see there. Although this design, we can also make it from wood. 
This will work very perfectly. We have done this. A very powerful hydroelectric generator was built on the dam which, it was very powerful, we installed a big alternator in it and gave it a business could be done. So you can watch this video by clicking here. I'll see you in the next video till then Jai Hind Jai Bharat.